welcome to Steve Taylor's High School Stars of the Week. I'm Nick Marconi, the Tom Cole, Terry Crosby, and Steve Taylor. And we got a great show, amazing show, actually. We got two track stars, yeah. both long jumpers. Tom, weren't you a long jumper too? Yeah, well, we were talking off air. Nick is, uh, I was, and uh, my, I was. Uh, Steve, Nick were, was. My, grand, my granddaughter's doing it now. Long jump is a cool thing. It's a very cool sport, and uh, I enjoyed the heck out of doing it. Yeah. Steve, take it away. Let's hear it. Let's talk about this amazing long jumper over at Mommy High School. We've got Lucas Polkingham. Yeah. And Lucas, uh, 20 some feet, 21 feet. Uh, and yes, Corey said seven. he thinks that he just broke that record again. After we saw this, yeah, oh yeah, that's that's well, crazy. Well, twenty-one. You put it in perspective. Nick and I were talking. Was the best jump? You know, any long jumper always say, "What's your best jump?" You know, yeah. and you remember that figure. And and uh, I couldn't break twenty. I was nineteen and change. Nick was like nineteen seven or something like that. But I'd like to let you in on the inside of all this long jumping talk, <laughs> just to know that you know our boss is there for us twenty four seven, Mr. Steve Taylor. And he said, "Man, he said I'd like to see you in a long jump pit." It would take a crane, a big boy crane, <laughs> to get you from the board to the pit. Now, you're looking at a guy that's lost. You ever seen like a mini excavator? Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know if the mini X would work. We'd have to go. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. why you're talking about the big boy, right? The, the full. Yeah, the big boy. The big boy. Yeah. yeah. And you and you're talking to a guy that's lost seven pounds. Okay. So you know, I don't know how fair. I don't know how fair that is, Nick. I, I don't know. But yeah, that that you know, you you jump at twenty one seven. You know, pace it off in your living room. Here's what you do it tonight. Pace off 21 feet, mark it with some tape, then give yourself a little runway down the hall, everybody has a hallway yeah. to the other bedrooms, <laughs> and then put a little spot of tape on that. Now this doesn't work as well on hardwood or rugs, but, and then give yourself a little sprint, take off at the tape spot, land on the hardwood or the rug. I, I don't recommend it, but, but it'll give you a feel of jumping 20 feet. Don't hit the China, ceiling either. Uh, on the bottom of the screen, when you write, uh, Taylor Lamer is not responsible for any uh, injuries. Uh, yeah. Broken legs, ankles, concussions. Yeah, no. I'm, I'm did, just did saying. Did you ever do a long jump? And, and I'll tell you one thing, boss. No, I, I, I didn't, boss. I didn't get very involved in track, but I can tell you this as fact. All four of us couldn't jump 16 feet, <laughs> every one of combined, okay? I don't know. It combined. Probably, I think Nick could get you <laughs> seven or eight today. I think what... Steve gets you seven or I eight. I think Terry's right. Standing yes. I jump. think Terry's right. I yes. think halfway down the runway, <laughs> pull hammy. I think, actually, I might try getting going so fast I just fall straight down. Right, you right, see right. that, you know, I and the fat that. guys are Well, well I know the first thing that's going to go on me. Yeah. Not one, but both my Achilles. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I've seen Cross lose the hand. I've seen that already. Yes. So, I don't know much about track and field. Yeah. Um, didn't participate. Yep. Didn't really watch it either. Right. But I have seen a video, and I don't know if this is a new way in the long jump of going. Uh, have these guys started running and then do a front forward flip? Yes. Yeah. And, That's and your absolute right. Momentum? Yeah, you're absolutely right. I think right. I've really? seen that. There's, yeah. a guy, wow. there's a guy that has done that. He How does do a forward that? He does a forward flip, forward but whatever flip. you hit in the sand, yeah. whether it's your Wait. hand, your head, your yeah. derriere, that's what they mark. Yeah. Yeah. So well, when you, you know, go and, yeah. it's like, uh, what do they call that uh, when you're jumping around the buildings and all that stuff, you know, like uh, Par parkour. Parkour. parkour, parkour, it's sort of like parkour yeah. now. I've seen that. Maybe China could find a clip and throw it in there. Yeah, that'd be that's, Well, that'd you know what, it's nice. interesting you say that, boss, because it's not unlike when everybody was high jumping and they used to scissor over the bar. Oh, yeah. With scissor, you just... Mm -hmm. Put the right. top leg and then went over. But then, and then they dove over. And then a guy came up with the Fosbury, Fosbury flop. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Where you flop over the bar and it allowed people to go so much further. Yeah. So I was watching 6th, 7th, and 8th graders do that. They had the form down already, which yeah, I think is amazing. Fosbury yeah, flop. I think it's amazing. That's you know, the cool. one, That's it, it, you're bringing up a great point. You know, if you go to track meets, the running is fun to watch. But go to the field events. I mean, some of those pole field events. I did pole, my, pole, pole. my daughter was trying to do that. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. I think the whole, like you said, you watch these, yeah. all these things. It's amazing. I could never even think about doing what they're doing, jumping and the field flop. events. And, 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 and if amazing. you're playing track and you're walking around because you like to watch all your friends competing or whatever, you're around the field events. You better keep your head up and your eyes open. Yeah. I had a buddy that Shot put. caught the uh, it caught the uh, discus. Oh, Took one to the side oh, of the wow. head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. The discus. So, you know, he was flat out. He was gone. I mean, I think they got safety night. precautions in, uh, <laughs> yeah. in the inside. Yeah, yeah. 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 So you got to keep uh, your head on a swivel. I'm the guy that caught the javelin. Oh, that man. That was that oh. was an old meat. 
you know, they stopped. The well, they oh, they stopped the javelin yeah. because of that. You know, huh? because uh, Terry Bradshaw was a great javelin thrower at Louisiana Tech, and if you watch him throw a football, Terry throws the football That's like a same. javelin. He does. He does that. It was yeah. all from being a good javelin thrower. So. Speaking of javelin, do you guys remember jarts? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. The lawn jarts. Those, yeah, yeah, lawn jarts. They got rid of those too. Yeah, that was fun. How about at the barbecue <laughs> that? Uh, hey, where's uh, where's Ralph? <laughs> uh, I don't know. He got he got jarted. Jarts, he got jarted. <laughs> hey, we, we we could just keep sitting. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. Never, Next jumper. Bring out who who's wants our to be next a jumper? <laughs> they bring that show back out, and you need to phone a friend. I'd be calling Tom. Tom knows <laughs> right, right, right. so much about so oh, many worthless things. information, boss. Oh know, no, I mean he's always. Yeah, I think it's great. It's great. Yes, absolutely, Especially man. Sports. He, he's a historian. Yeah, he, story, he knows everything. Or as Steve told me earlier this morning, he's history. <laughs> <laughs> well, what, All right, what, what year is Lucas? What year is he? You know, I do not know that. Oh, so you don't know that though. I do not. <laughs> I do not know that. Cor All right, Corey we're might know that. We're heading down to Finley, uh, where we have got Good job, another Lucas. long jumper. Yep. Um, Caitlin, Caitlin Snick. Stechelty. 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 I know that because I had a second grade teacher, Mrs. Stechelty. Wonder if they're related. Yeah, yeah. Could be. They could be related. That's, uh, 1610 yeah. is her number, Yeah, which is unbelievable. Yeah, I mean, again, you, you need to go to track meets and watch these kids uh, <clears throat> participate. The running events are extremely cool. You have young ladies today running the 100 in 11, like 11-1, 11 11-2. 11 that's... Mm -hmm. yep. I'm telling you, I you know we couldn't do it in a car. I mean, right. it, seriously, that's that's impressive. Mm -hmm. But sixteen ten is big time. So, uh, Caitlin, you're doing a great job. And just yeah. like everything else, in in any sport, it's, it's just so advanced these days. Yeah. You, yeah. you know what I mean? And the athletes are bigger, faster. You, you know, it's yeah. amazing what they can do. Yeah. And and they're coached better too. Nothing pejorative to old time coaches, but the techniques they coach right. today oh, yeah. right. are so much better. I mean, it's not even in the ball. But you know, I don't agree with uh, the way the NBA has transitioned into 16, seven foot, seven, seven, five, whatever, shooting three, three. Yeah, 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 yeah. Why are we talking about NBA now? Yeah, I mean, I'm just, I'm just saying, <laughs> we're, talking <laughs> we're talking about sports. We're talking about sports in general, okay? Oh, okay. You know, I mean, that's crazy. I'll what about Coach Ram and uh, Zernike? Great. Uh, no, they were really good track coaches. No, Joe, Joe Zernick was the first track coach. He was in my history. long jump coach. First in the history. He was, he was mine. Oh, man. You and I. <laughs> first in the history of saying, but he never cared about me jumping because he had John Swan jump at right, 25. Jump at <laughs> so my 19 was like, you know, yeah. hey, Tom, good job, Tom. Hey, Tom, that's real nice. Go, <laughs> go get on the spot. bus. Yeah, go, get us, go, go get us a soda. Go get a towel. Can you get us a. <laughs> you know, DeVoe <laughs> High School had some great they, track. Yeah, great track. With Dean yeah. Mosky yeah, 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 and. Uh, yeah. Coach yeah. Bud, Topola, yeah. yeah, back and, in the day. And Mike Schramm was a great track coach. Yep, you know, sure. They were very good. Shout out to my son, too, Colin, on the St. John's yes. Jesuit Academy team. So he placed second uh, at the Finley meet in the 200 cool. meter. And then his 4x100 team, they got third place. So good job, well, Colin. I, I'm team. just wondering, I just have to ask the question. Oh, geez, here we go. Where did he get his athletic <laughs> Hey, Nick played football at St. John's, played track at St. John's, multiple yeah. sport athlete. Freshman, oh, okay. freshman varsity, yeah. I was a four by one hundred with um, Marvin Phillips, oh, Marv Peter was, Marv was and, tough. Yeah, the one other guy I can't remember. Marv was a great football player. Oh, yeah, he was. They, uh, <laughs> yeah, it sounds like they needed one more. They didn't, was, somebody didn't show up. Hey, Marconi, get over here. <laughs> Nick Seahawk well, was. Was he under reserve? I could not get under reserve. I'll tell you one thing though: in in the, the boys' schools, well, in all the schools, but especially the St. John's, St. Francis Central, though, it seems like. It's not easy to make these teams. I want to tell you what. Yeah. You know, you make a team there. You know, you you've done something. It's Absolutely. it's just very difficult. If you make a team, you should be proud of it because it's the competition is uh, right. pretty ruthless. Yeah. Cool. All these schools now. Yeah. You know, it's uh, it's not easy to make teams. You know, you'd be able to go out in high school and try out for a team now. Yeah. Now these kids are starting in first grade. Well, they play all right. the travel. They play yeah. all the year. All professionals. AAU, AAU, and all that. Yeah. When yeah. I was That's playing, crazy. the test so was uh, you're upright and you're breathing. Hey, you made the team. You know. Hey, and Tom, you, uh, you know what? China right. has cut the film. Just so <laughs> know, the, the show's over. We can just continue to talk. But we talk for swimming. Watching, uh, Steve Taylor. Uh, China said so 20 smart. minutes into the show, and I've got to stop. All right. Can't All stop. right. You right, China? Yes. <laughs> hey, everybody. Thanks for tuning in to another edition of Steve Taylor's <laughs> Sports Sports yeah, Network. Nick says it's not high school stars anymore. Potpourri. Yeah, it's uh, a little bit of everything. Uh, shout out to Marco's Pizza, too. Tom's down seven pounds. Uh, Marco's.
canceled and has <laughs> stopped giving us pizza. But thank you, Marcos, for like thinking about it. <laughs> Good All food. right, everybody, we'll see you next week. And I believe next week might be our, our last, 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 last show. Yeah, it is. Last it is. High School yeah. Stars of the Week show. Oh. Yeah. We'll talk about all sorts of things. Yeah. Uh, That'll be an hour-long show, so stay tuned. That'll I think be we're going to pick up uh, some very... Uh, cricket. Yeah, huh? cricket. Yeah. 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 Terry's going to give us a yes. breakdown on cricket. Uh, I know cricket. about cricket. I don't know anything on, about cricket. On our last show, boss, because we... Three-day sport. <laughs> last week. <laughs> Could I talk about uh, the time I was asked to go in and save Haystacks Calhoun at White House Quarry? That's a good story. 500 pounder. Yeah, the 500 pounder. Yeah. Were you a lifeguard? What? Yeah. Oh, wow. I think you've mentioned wow. that a few times. I have. It's, it's a traumatic experience. But I think it would be a good good story. It would be a good closer. Yeah, it would be a good closer. So, our show next week. Yeah. One hour. Plan on an hour next week, everybody. <laughs> we'll see you then. Take care. <laughs>